Sit down, relax. See yourself sitting where you are. Feel yourself sitting where you are. Take a deep breath in and out. In and out. And once more in and out. And we're going to reach down and grow roots from our feet. Grow them down through the floor, through the basement, into the earth far below the house. With each breath, push them down further around the rocks and through the soil far below. And keep on searching down and down. Go around the boulders and down deep into the earth until you find the bedrock far, far below. You find that bedrock, search around, find that pool of water, waters of chaos, far beneath the earth, the cool, clear, crisp waters. And we're going to bring those up and bring those into our body. With each breath, bring the waters up through the roots and into your feet. Next breath brings them up into our legs and into our loins. As we breathe, they come further up into our bellies and into our chests. With each and every breath, they come higher and higher till they come out of our heads and out of our hands, spilling back into the earth. The cool waters from far below, filling us with the energies, the energies of the waters, the energies of earth from far below. Feel yourself, enjoy these energies. Then we're going to reach up and grow branches up through the sky, through the roofs, and keep on reaching up and up until you get past the clouds and you find that one star high above your head. Here you're going to pull in the light from above, the fires of water from above. Bring those down in through your branches, and into your hands. With each breath, you bring this light down into your body, into your head, into your chest. See it mix with the waters as you bring it down into your bellies and into your loins. With each and every breath, you fill your body up down to your feet with this light from above. And each breath brings you up again with the water from, from below, mixing throughout your body glowing with the fires and waters, the cool crisp waters from below, the fire and light from above, mixing throughout your body, glowing, filling you with the energies. Enjoy these energies, take in these energies, fill yourself up with all that you need. And when you're ready, Put the fires back to the sky, push the waters back down to the earth, and bring in your roots and branches. Keep all that you need, but send away any of the excess. And know that at any time, if you ever need any of these energies, you can always reach up and reach down and pull them into you whenever you need them. But for now, Take a deep breath in and out, in and out. And when you're ready, join us, ready for magic. First, we make offerings to the Earth Mother. Earth Mother, you who surround us and support us. Without you, we would not be here. You give us shelter. You give us food. You give us this interesting weather that we've been having. For all that you do for us throughout the days, throughout the weeks, the months, and the years, Earth Mother, accept our offerings. We are here to honor the gods. We're here to ask blessings of the gods. 
the land spirits and the ancestors. But first, we hallow our hallows. Mighty wells, you reach deep into the earth and you connect us to the worlds of the ancestors. We give you this silver. We ask sacred waters flow within us. And mighty fires, you burn and you transform. You send to the heavens all that we offer, taking them to the shining ones. We offer you this incense. We say, sacred fire, burn within us. A mighty tree, your roots go deep into the earth, into the wells and the lands of the ancestors. And your branches grow high into the sky, to the realm of the shining ones. Your pathway between all the worlds, we say, sacred tree, grow within us. And my grove, and in all of our groves, by the light of the water, and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water and the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. So be it. Gatekeepers all, we call to you today as we've called to you many times before, and we ask that you aid us in our works this evening. We ask that you take our messages far and wide, that you bring back to us all that we need to hear, that you watch over us as we walk your holy roads, you guard us and protect us as we do our works this evening. Gatekeepers all, for all that you will do for us, we ask gatekeepers, accept our offerings. Now, gatekeepers, as you join your magic mind in my grove and in all of our groves, like the waters open. It's a gate to the underworlds. The fires open as a gate to the upper worlds. Let the tree be the crossroads between all the worlds, open to our spirits and open to our voices. Let the gates be opened. Shining ones, gods and gods of elder days, you, who each of us call our matrons and patrons, we offer you welcome to each and every one of you that are of this very land where we live. We call to you and we offer you welcome. To all of you unknown, each and every one of you that looks over us, whether we know it or not, we offer you welcome. Come, join us by our fires. Shining ones, accept our offerings. Land spirits, be you fur and feather, scale and skin, all the animal kin, we offer you welcome. Be you leaf and stem, flower and, tw and twig, all the plant kin, we offer you welcome. Be you unseen, and all the names that you get called by, we offer you welcome. Come and join us by our fire. Land spirits, accept our offerings. And ancestors, all of you who are family that have passed, we offer you welcome. To all of you that we considered friends and idols and mentors, our chosen family, we offer you welcome. 
to all of you of this very land where we are. We offer you welcome. Come, join us by our fire. Land spirits, accept our offerings. At this point, there are offerings to be made to any of the kindreds. Please feel free to make them. Kindred, watch over us as we enter this holiday season. Guide us, ward us. Mighty Kindred, accept my offerings. The offerings have all been made, and we make the prayer of sacrifice. Mighty kindreds, gods, dead, and land spirits, we give to you, and we are asking as part of our bargain that you give back to us. Mighty spirits, accept our sacrifice. And now, mighty kindred, we ask, what blessings do you receive? Do we receive from you? Shining ones, what blessings do we receive? Receive Tila's tear, right action. Last spirit, what blessings do we receive? Isa, ice. Stagnation. And considering where I am in upstate New York, it could very well be snow. And ancestors, what blessings do we receive? <laughs> Lathila, home and inheritance. Family. We are being given the gifts of doing the right thing to get past this stagnation, to get past any blockages we have within our families. I think these are very powerful and very good omens. Do we accept these omens? Since there's no objections, by a kindred, We've given to you, or we ask, good Gossi tradition, a gift calls for a gift. Fill these waters in my hands and these waters in each and every one of our homes. Fill them with Tiwas and right action. Fill them with Isa, the stagnation that we are going to get through. And fill these with Othila, our friends, home, and family. Fill these waters with these omens we have just received. Fill these with these blessings we have just received. Mighty <sighs> kindred. Behold the waters of life. nothing else to be done. And we thank all of those who have aided us in our works this evening. Ancestors, be you family, be you chosen family, or be you of this very earth, for all that you do for us in our daily lives and all you've done for us tonight. Ancestors, we thank you. Land spirits, be you our animal kin, our plant kin, or the unseen kin, for all that you do for us throughout the days and all you've done for us throughout this rite. Land spirits, we thank you. And shining ones, be you our matrons and patrons, be you of this very earth, 
or be you unknown to us. To each and every one of you for all that you do throughout our daily lives and all that you have done for us tonight. Shining ones, we thank you. And Gatekeeper, you have once again aided us in our works this evening. You have watched over us as we've traveled far and wide. You've brought back for us these wonderful omens. For all that you do for us, Gatekeepers, we thank you. I ask once more, Gatekeepers, that you join your match with mine and my house and all of our houses. Let the water become, let the well become but water once more. Let the fire become a flame once more. Let the tree become but a tree once more. Let the gates be closed. We call on you first and we honor you last. Earth Mother, for all that you do for us, we cannot praise you enough. We cannot honor you enough. But for now, we say, Earth Mother, we thank you. And go now, children of Earth, in wisdom and peace, for the rite has ended. <laughs>